I'm gonna have to actually read this, sorry. <laughs> Um, I don't know if you guys know uh, the story of Venus. Venus was uh, actually married to Vulcan, but she never really loved him. The tragedy of Aphrodite. The tragedy of Aphrodite. She was this badass party chick. Her copper tone, crimson, heavenly body could incinerate the breath of you. The type of chick that could make the gayest boy straight that can make all the fives in the room think they feel, wish they never came. Hated and despised, she felt she held beauty in her eyes and love in her hips. Like a helium-filled zeppelin, she could easily burst into flames. Ego ballooned inflated to the point that at any second it might pop. Perugian statuesque, a two-faced Tessa cat that grins the truth, Aphrodite's never deserved love. The bloody tragedy of never not knowing, of never knowing, of never not knowing, of achieving extravagantly, of knowing that her own father pimped her out, that the gods laid in wait, sucking up all the air, feeding the flame deviously because they, because they hated her and how she fought in her beauty and how she never claimed she knew love. For once the curtains were pulled back, her celestial rose petals fell. Aphrodite became the first revenge born. When she adorned her love to Ares who never loved her, who never saw her for anything other than a prize, the same way that Aphrodite held most in her eyes, Ares. Man, she called comfort is dead. <laughs> the tragedy, Ares, exuding all confidence when he devised this plan to turn Aphrodite's 10 easily into a six. That's probably when she got slapped in the face. The tragedy of the goddess of love and beauty's hers was a trap of the bittersweet carcasses of dead things, of flames of Hades and all his deadly sins, Aphrodite was at least four of them. Because everyone Aphrodite has ever loved felt her wrath. Cities fell, thousands died, husbands killed their wives, killed themselves, people ate their children. For this selfish, self-centered, self-absorbed, badass party chick, Processed like a thin layer of plastic, cosmetic beauty, skin deep, scarlet beauty, beauty so vain, vanity itself, which the interest, as she proclaims, you know this boy likes me. Wanting him to lust after it, wanting me to lust after it, wanting, wanting to see envy in their eyes, she was desire's true addiction. So in the long run, tragically, by the time Paris burned, the same way, and they're not a god, Aphrodite's the seductress. Never knowing love was already dead. Yeah, that's uh, you know, you, you, I think everybody here has loved somebody who didn't really deserve their love. Man, talk about it. All right, I'm we'll do one more. All right. <laughs> you, you know what I think. <laughs> the craziness. Vital signs of being weighed nuclear fusion to divide like clones of human beings from Attica to Gattaca of rapists being convicted by sequel DNA steam cells retroviruses. If you do not leave a park in here in this lot right now, get your ass out there. <laughs> <laughs> Pay for a movie car. I'm so sorry. It was beautiful. There's a parking sleeve in there. So, in the parking lot right here, if you didn't pay, I'm just letting y'all know. They got me last time. It's great. So, if you didn't pay, you should. <laughs> yeah, all right. Of rapists being convicted by a single DNA steams retrovirus and descendants from the battles of Bells while towers fall and Connie Chung is still talking. Today in the news, right wing organizations are outraged as President George W. Bush says he also reports himself research. The craziness. 
The craziness of black Jesus coming back from the dead. The craziness. The craziness got me. The craziness got me. No longer can I break free. Jesus Christ saved me from the apocalyptic comings of billions of dollars bombing me for the love of money. Has us blocking out the sun so the oil is you won't be gone. Staying strong in the craziness you guess is like incense at best to a dust to the wicked ways of demons with barcodes on their forehead. Is this shit real? Or am I hallucinating from all the drugs I took to make it all go away?